Hello, my name is Doug Schmidt, and I'd like to welcome you to our MOOC on Programming Mobile Services for Android Handheld Systems, which focuses on a range of Android application and middleware programming topics, including threading and concurrency control mechanisms, background service processing, local interprocess communication, and application security. This is the second course in our specialization on mobile cloud computing with Android, which is the first trans-institutional sequence of MOOCs taught on the Coursera platform by myself, Professor Adam Porter at University of Maryland, and Professor Jules White at Vanderbilt University. Before we delve into the techniques, tools, and methods associated with programming concurrent applications and services on Android, this section gives an overview of the entire specialization in general, and this MOOC in particular. We start by outlining how the MOOCs in our specialization build upon and codify decades of research and development we've conducted together and separately to provide you with an integrated learning experience that blends coverage of software design and architecture, human-computer interaction, accessibility, and usability, Java programming language features and idioms, communication and concurrency patterns and frameworks, database design and programming techniques, cybersecurity, automated testing, and more. Next, I'll explain the course organization, assignments, and assessment methods, as well as outline the main topics in each section. Since teaching and taking MOOCs is different from traditional face-to-face -face courses, I'll also explain this course's prerequisites and expectations, as well as provide some tips on how to leverage online resources to master the material we cover in the videos and successfully complete the programming assignments. Finally, I'll present an overview of patterns and frameworks, which are topics that underlie most material in this MOOC. Throughout this MOOC, we'll analyze dozens of pattern-oriented Java and Android applications, some of which we've developed, and others that reside in Android's middleware, class libraries, and packaged applications, which apply many patterns and frameworks. These examples showcase the pattern-oriented software architecture techniques, tools, and methods you need to successfully develop your own concurrent mobile applications and services on Android.